Sidelander for third. So in less than one corner, we'd had the top four positions change. Cloud of dust back in the back of the shot there. Can't tell you who it is to drop the wheel off. No harm, though. As we continue around the race, look at there's Jarier and Hubert Haupt now in fifth and sixth. On board with Kelvin Burke. You're looking back at Burn Mylander as they have sort of pulled away from fifth and sixth place. Jarier and Hubert Haupt. In fact, right now, Burke is pulling away from Burn Mylander. And White Dot is getting smaller in the screen. Now, is he on the inside making a pass? Yes, Mike Hesman, our early race leader, has now been bumped back to third place. And all of a sudden, look who comes up right back on the doorstep and maybe making a pass of his own. Burn Mylander gets underneath Kelvin Burt. We told you this was a great driver series. These guys are putting on one tremendous display of driving talent. And literally in two corners, we've had two separate passes. The gross gets wide out into the sand and gravel trap and boy Manuel Reuter barely escaped and then Gross overcorrects and ends up going all the way around kicking out quite a few stones that'll make that corner interesting for a few laps don't get wide there or you'll be out into the sand trap forever back up front with Uwe Alton stay as has been trying desperately to get his first victory of the year. So far, Fabian Giroux is the only man who has defeated Uwe Alton. Boy, looks like uh, got a little, and he got past Hesman. Looks like he's got problems. And now we're on board with Kelvin Burt looking back as Mike Hesman has a problem at this point. And we found out later his gearbox was beginning to slip.